Yes, guys, how are we doing? So, muscle work today with Nick. Uh, first time coming here myself. In for a full session. So weird going to the gym for the first time. You have no idea what there is. Um, warming up on this bit of a lat activation. And then moving on to the bar. A row movement, a couple of movement. Two sets per exercise. Let's go. Back. Drama queen, a hypochondriac, a hero, none of that Even if I was a running back, ain't no energy for my enemy Threading it carefully, you ain't no friend of me How do you better me? Ain't no four jigger like the killer did the Kennedy How you feeling? How you feeling? I think I'ma make the earth shake Break it down, break it down, what's the work rate? How you feeling? I think I'ma make the earth shake Break it down, break it down, what's the work rate? I don't wanna run it fast for the fans cause I'm always too tense I'm Transylvania, so I might do it for the second as a veteran and better with the flow with the notes, put a bit of what a jigger note. I don't wanna lose, I don't wanna go. So I've been the rules in the boot, man. I might fight with the right mic. Even one set in, mate. This T bar is tough, really fucking tough. Ah. Yes, yes, how are we doing? So, um, slightly weird angle this one. We've found out oh, this is the worst. Poor car. <laughs> Terrible for video. <laughs> Awful. It's the worst car to, to set up the old tripod. But, so, pool session finished. What'd you make of the gym? Decent. Yeah, that was awesome. Easily one of the best gyms I've yeah. been to. Because you, have you yet to be in King, King's Gym, is it? Or? No, I haven't been King's. Yeah. Um, Ripped is probably the best gym I've been to. Mm hmm before that but yeah it was it was it was quality and proper clean it was yeah it was this tidy good atmosphere wasn't it yeah man yeah really really good atmosphere so with the pool session today obviously as i've spoken before it's very very hard to work out exactly what you're going to do top set and back off and just have to feel for the movements because like we were talking before everything's set out slightly different so with a particular um, piece of equipment the resistance is, is, is slightly different and, and different parts, isn't it? Yeah, all the strength um, curves are slightly different. Yeah. So it's getting a feel for that, isn't it, before before going in for loading sets. And sometimes you, you go into it and you think, oh, yeah, that sound like can load up to two or three plates and, yeah, it's not going to happen. Or, if anything, it's too light. Harsh reality. So, yeah. <laughs> so, first working set, we went straight into, like, a T-bar row. For me, I asked Nick to um, to start with a row movement because my, my goal at the moment is back thickness is something that I'm really lacking. So, T-bar row, top set, uh, like a 5 to 9, back off 10 to 12. Uh, I think we did three, three and a half plates for the yeah. top set. Um, which that was very very difficult in terms of I think it was was it the lower part of the movement or was it the top part of the movement where it was it was really uh, tough. The top part. So getting that like last contraction, like last bit of the contraction was definitely killer. It was <laughs> it was hard. And as you guys know, anything that's chest supported, which is fantastic in terms of isolating the actual muscle group, but in terms of actually like breathing, bracing, it's yeah. I got a sharp cool. pain in my rib, didn't I? <laughs> Leaning into it too much. Ask Nick oh, how he's how he's feeling. He said five minutes. I'm I'm done. Like yeah. <laughs> ready to ready to spew. Uh, then straight into the back off set as well. Second movement we went for. I don't actually know what that sort of lat movement was called. It was an Arsenal one, wasn't it? Yeah, Arsenal strength. Uh, I don't know. It was just like a free moving lat pull down, wasn't it? Because mm. the handles were like completely mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. free moving. 
it was quite cool because once you got into position you could either go one way or you can go the other way we went more for like a hammer pull down variation uh both together so we didn't do unilateral or anything like that um top set back off we went for the back off we went for a, a little bit more volume in there um, i think top set wise we were I think it was a was it twenty and a, twenty and ten each side twenty and fifteen. Yeah, I think so. It was, it, was such a, it was such a harsh strength curve, wasn't it? Yeah, the top part was brutal, horrible, absolutely, uh, absolutely disgusting. And I think back off, we just went sort of twenty twenty five sides, yeah. aimed for like sort of fourteen fifteen reps. Third move, we went another chest supported row. This time, uh, unilateral work. Um, it was just like a just a basic kind of hammer, um, not hammer, basically just like a. It was hammer strength, wasn't it? Was it hammer strength, was it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, hammer strength, uh, Yeah, just like a seated row, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. The um, plate-loaded one. With that one, it was very, very narrow, so you had to kind of turn outwards a little bit, driving with the elbow, um, and uh, we could we could load that up, couldn't we? Top set, I think, what was it? So four plates side? Yeah, four plates side. So I think we was aiming for eight reps, weren't we? Yeah. Yeah, that yeah. was good, that. I ended up standing up on that one just because weight was quite heavy so you had to like really pin yourself against the pad didn't you mm. that was good because nick worked out quite quickly that like the seat could go obviously lower or upper um lower or high as you, as, as you want but you you kind of worked out actually it's better if you just stand get that chest support first and then just focus yeah. purely on the handles were really narrow so, as well weren't they yeah so you had to almost stand up and shift your whole body over to the side just so you had enough room to retract your scapula enough wasn't it mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah that no, was good Top and the back off, uh, 8 to 10, and sort of like 10 to 15, I think we've got 12 for the back off set. The fourth movement, we used the mag grips, which um, I think that's the second time I've used it before. First time for yourself with those grips, or? I've used the narrow one before. Yeah. But um, yeah, we used like, it was like a supinated grip, wasn't it? But it was quite mm. wide, mm. that was good. Yeah. It was, um, yeah, and then we, did, we made the back off set a rest pause set. So rest pause set, rest for 10 seconds, and then go, go again. Terrible idea. It was, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think then we were just we were just so fucked from, really? from that point. Uh, then we went into rear delts. We did sort of two or three sets um, on the actual kind of like resistance. It was a peg deck, wasn't it, but you reverse it. Yes. Yeah. Let me just move this up slightly. Um, that was tough. That was very, very tough. Um, but ideal for the rear delts. Then we just did one set of like a low row, uh, 10 to 15 reps, just for that contraction at the bottom part of the lat, wasn't it? Yeah, I normally put that in at the beginning, but just where we wanted to focus on other movements, it was threw it in at the end fairly light, didn't we? But high yeah. reps. Yeah. That was good. Then we just finished with biceps, and I think at this point we've just we're absolutely gone. So I think we we tried it. Was a, half hearted, wasn't it? <laughs> it was half hearted. It was a reluctant. Do we kind of have to? But we had to, we have to get it done. So we tried like a some sort of preacher curl variation. Um, the two that we used just weren't quite right in terms of didn't feel quite right on the elbow plus the position. Um, so we went for just dumbbell stand hammer curls, just purely. They were in pounds as well, which was. Yeah, sitting there on our phones working out quickly what to... Uh... Yeah, it's... Um, thank God for phones, that's all, that's all I can say. Um, so we, we did a couple sets. I used 45 pounds, which I think yeah, is roughly 20 kilos. That I'm, I'm not too sure. A bit more than that, I think, it was, uh, Yeah, that was good. Um, I opted for 40s, slightly. Yeah. Slightly lighter. <laughs> Still struggled. <laughs> Two or three... Uh, we, we both worked out that we, we we definitely need some sort of tan, don't we? We're oh, we're, we're struggling with the that um, lighting in there just made me look like a ghost. Yeah, I completely lost Nick in, in, in yeah. the dumbbells. <laughs> <laughs> um, then we went into well, it's probably just one set, some sort of seated, um, kind of like a preacher curl, kind of wasn't it? Yeah, it was, unilateral work. Yeah, it supported your upper arm, didn't it? Mm. Um, but. I feel like it was built for someone a lot with a lot shorter limbs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like you couldn't fully extend at the bottom and curling to the top was okay, but like it felt clunky moving because mm. it was a, uh, yeah, it wasn't just a straight cable, was it? It was like, like you had a mechanical arm. <laughs> Something wasn't right. Something was no. not right there at all. I think it's one of those machines you need to have a play with, isn't it? And get mm -hmm. the seat adjustment right and... We just couldn't be bothered. We just, by that we point. just didn't have that time for, for patience. No. That was just out the window right completely. <laughs> and that was the end of the session. Quick piss and then food and then drive home. Yep.
We shouldn't take too long to get here. So, yeah, let's go get some food. So when the wait at Nando's is too long, you have to go for the next best thing, uh, which is McDonald's. A <laughs> um, couple of McDonald's wraps as post-workout. Very, very good session today at Muscle Works. Really, really like that gym there. We definitely said that we're going to potentially go up there and do a leg session one day in the future because the leg equipment looked incredible. There was like seven different leg press machines. Um, so yeah, definitely gonna do that. We're also gonna do a potential YouTube series of like away days. Try and train as many gyms as possible. Um, I would say all up and down the country, but probably in this kind of southern area in terms of uh, Chelmsford, London, anything like that. And yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Drop this a comment if you like this. Also comment below if there's any gyms that you want to see me train at. Um, or any gyms that you'd highly recommend, go ahead and do so. Subscribe if you haven't already, like this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.